Hey everyone, I uh, just wanted to take a quick minute and show you my blood knot hack. This knot, whenever I teach a lot of new fishermen how to tie this knot, whether you're adding two tippets together, adding tippet onto your leader, other applications where you're putting two similar thickness lines together, um, this is a great knot, but a lot of people struggle with it. So I wanted to share that with you. Um, but before I get into that, I want to just let you know that we have a lot of new videos coming out right now. Um, just to be able to help you guys with your fishing, you know, stuff like this for demonstration purposes. Uh, we have some on the stream videos coming out soon, uh, as well as a few other things and tutorials here and there. So make sure that you go ahead, check down below there, subscribe to our channel, hit that little bell icon so you get notified whenever we bring out our videos. I'm trying to put one out every single week on Monday mornings. Uh, so be sure to check in on your YouTube channel and uh, check out our videos as we're bringing them out. So this video, like I said, we're going to talk about uh, the blood knot. I've been working on this knot for a number of years, been showing people this little hack that I have here to make your life a little bit easier, and I think you're going to enjoy it. So I'm going to bring you up closer in a second, show it off to you, and then you guys will be able to tie this in no time. So here is my blood knot hack. So this knot is utilized uh, for adding tippet onto your leader or any two sizes of line that are similar in diameter. So the premise of this knot is you have two lines, you twist them together eight times an equal number, you find the middle, pull it apart, put one tag end in this way, one tag end in the other, pull tight. The hardest part, in my opinion, is finding the middle of that, especially when you're using small tippets like a 6X. So here's my little hack that'll help you out with everything. So, and I have my, my tag end or my long ends by my pinkies and my working ends here by my pointer and thumb. Using the orange and the yellow, I'm gonna work with the yellow side. So we're gonna do half the knot first. Four twists, one, two, three, four. So half of our knot is done. We can continue to twist eight times if we wanted to, but instead of having to find the middle later, we're gonna put our first tag end through there and continue the other four twists. One two, three, four. So now we've got eight twists through there. That orange end that we stuck in earlier, if we straighten everything out here, is already in the middle. So you can see the middle there. We've already found it. And now it's easier for us to pull apart. The orange end is coming through this way. We're gonna take the yellow end We're going to stick it through the other way. So there's our middle. It's twisting up on me. We're going to put the yellow in the other way through. Okay? So now we've got four twists here, four twists there, one tag end in, one tag end in. So all you need to do is give it a little pull, and there's your blood knot. So you can see that the line is completely straight after you've attached them, and your tag ends are opposite. So you kind of create a square there with everything. All you're gonna do is trim the other ends, and you're good to go. So remember, four twists, put one tag end in, keep twisting four other times, find the middle, stick your other end through. That is it, that's my blood knot hack to help you guys out. So we learned that great knot and how to tie that blood knot in no time, save you guys a little bit of trouble on it, and uh, utilize that hack on the stream, off the stream for tying up your leaders and other applications there. So once again, be sure to subscribe to our channel, check that bell icon, and also go to our website, which is www.risenfly.com. Check out all of our gear. It's fall season, winter's coming close. We've got some great opportunities for fishing. Um, so check out everything that we have on the website and uh, you'll be able to get stocked up for all of your fishing needs and keep a little extra money in your pocket compared to some of the bigger companies out there. We appreciate you guys all watching. Thank you again and we'll see you next time.